Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening sa inyo mga Miao Miss and mga Miao Dis. So welcome back to our channel. And today, let's talk about one of the most alarming condition ng ating cat or ating mga cats and ating mga dogs. And that is dehydration. Um, bakit ba nagkakaroon ng dehydration? Una, um, it's because they're unwell, they're sick. And kapag sick ang mga cats, um, napakadalang nilang uminom. And um, madalang din silang kumain. So yung water, which is very important not only to humans but also to um, our cats and our dogs. Kasi our body is composed of, you know, water. And so we need to have water all the time. It has to be balance and it has to be replenished para hindi magkaroon ng imbalance yung katawan ng aso at ng pusa, even tayong mga tao. Paano nyo malalaman naman kung dehydrated yung pusa nyo? Simple, tingnan nyo lang yung batok ng pusa. I mean, hawakan nyo yung batok ng pusa. Ganito. Hilda, gagamitin kita Hilda. Total naman, marami kang kinakain. Pwede? Pwede kitang gamitin? Oh, sige. Sige na. May bago ko ng papel sa buhay. Okay. So, ang gagawin mo kay Hilda or gagawin sa mga cats ninyo ay hawakan nyo yung batok. Ayan. Nakikita nyo siya. Igawin nyo siya. Kapag hindi siya bumalik agad-agad, sobrang tagal. Yung tipong parang makunat na balat na ang bagal niya bago siya bumalik sa original form niya, it means that the cat is dehydrated. Okay? So, ano bang... Um, dapat gawin kapag dehydrated or kapag may sakit ang pusa at nagkaroon na siya ng dehydration, first, you really need to bring them to the vet so that they would be able to understand kung anong reason kung ba't siya may dehydration kasi maraming reasons kung ba't dehydrated ang pusa. Ay, wait lang! Sabi yung si ano si Hilda. Marami kasing reasons kung bakit dehydrated ang cats. One is meron silang kidney failure or meron silang kidney problems. Um, second, dahil sa kainitan or dahil sa sobrang init, um, mabilis silang ma, ma, mag, ano, mabilis silang mapagod, mabilis silang ma-dehydrate. Okay? And then third, ayun si Hilda, medyo nagkukulit-kulit si Hilda. Gusto niyo daw ng pagkain, malapit daw kasi ang dinner time. Eh, 4 pa lang naman. 4.30 pa lang kaya, di, ano, Hilda. Anyway, so, and there are a lot of factors, um, to be considered kung bakit nagkakaroon ng dehydration. Pero, the moment that you bring them to the vet, they would be able to understand kung anong dapat gawin. In most cases, lalo na sa Philippines set up, ang kadalasang pinapagawa ng vet is to treat kung ano man yung underlying reason kung bakit sila may sakit. And then about dehydration, normally what they would do kapag ano, kapag kaya naman ang budget nyo is i-IV fluid sila, intravenous fluid. So, ito yung may swero. Or, they would recommend that you buy them um, Mondex. It's a powder dextrose. Uh, may, iba mga, may mga iba pang brand ng powder dextrose. Umura lang talaga ang Mondex. It would range around 100 to 150. At yung malaki na yon. So, pwede kayong bumili nyo and matagalan yung magagamit. Pang matagalan yung magagamit yon. Ngayon naman, if ever na wala kayong budget and you want to do it using um, ingredients that you have at home, then it's good. You can do it at home. Um, you can create your own electrolyte water. How do you do that? Una, kailangan nyo ng 1 liter of mineral water. Second, you need to have 1 teaspoon of salt. And then third, you need to use 1 half teaspoon of baking soda. And then lastly, you need to have 3 tablespoons of honey. Why honey? Because it's all natural. But kung wala talaga kayong honey sa bahay, then sugar lang tayo. Okay? Paano siya i-prepare? Simple lang. Una, pakuluan mo muna yung 1 liter of mineral water. Kapag kumulo na siya, patayin mo yung apoy. And then, ilagay mo na yung mga ingredients mo. Let it sit until ma-reach nyo na yung room temperature. Or pag lumamig na siya, that's the time that you will give it to your cat. 
or to your dog. And that's good for one day. Yung um, ginawa mo, that's good for one day. So those are the ways on how you can um, work on issues related to dehydration. I hope you learned something today and um, if you have any questions, just feel free to comment down below so that I can answer them based on our experiences. And thank you so much for your time, mga meowmies and mga meowdies. Don't forget to click the subscribe button as well as the notification bell so that you will be made aware kapag meron na po tayong mga bagong upload na video. So thank you and have a great and lovely day. Bye for now! Meow, 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 meow! Ah.